the 2014 Mercedes-Benz E-Class undergoes a major facelift for the year 2014. Freshly re-sculpted, distinctive wheel and bow body detailing highlight the thoroughbred performance of the sport sedans. A bow slatted grille incorporates the star for the first time in an E-Class sedan, reflecting its place among the most sporty models in its family. The sport tuned suspension gives it a confident stance. Set off by more aggressive sculpting of its bumper and side seals, its corners are now softer as the formerly flare rear fenders now appear more tight and toned, and the overall package display a more cohesive and athletic look than did the previous model years. An icon of style for generation, the E-Class is foremost an ever advancing role model for the entire auto industry. Its dramatically new design reflect the abundance of new technology within, from its aerodynamic refinements to its LED lightning all around. And with distinctive new wheel, grille, and bumper design, the E-Class Sport and Luxury sedan stand apart from each other as much as they stand out in any crowd. Up front, you see the LED headlamps and daytime running lamps with longer life and quicker illumination and beams that approximate daylight even more closely than Xenon headlamps. The new standard LED headlamps enhance both vision and visibility during nighttime driving. Located in between the two headlamps are the double crosswing design grille with a three-point star Mercedes-Benz logo which comes only in the sport styling version of the E350. Set off by a more aggressive sculpting aerodynamic lower front bumper body kit. This particular model comes with sporty 17-inch alloy wheels with a dynamic twin 5-spoke design and are a no-charge option on the E350 Sport Sedan. They come fitted with all-season tires. Here is the side view mirror with integrated LED turn signal light. To the back, you see the LED tail lamps, redesigned tail lamps employ LED technology for every function, and with distinctive form, brighter than traditional incandescent bulbs, LED technology also deliver quicker illumination of the brake lamps by offering driver behind you more time to react. This could make a critical difference in the panic stop. At the bottom, you see the black diffuser outlined by a chrome strip that frame the dual chrome tip exhaust. Alright, the car does come equipped with Smart Access Key System with the key in your pocket. Press the button on the door handle once to lock. After a few seconds, put your hand on the door handle to unlock. The interior features black leather seats, black dash and door panels with burr wanted wood trim on all four doors panel, dash and center console. Alright, let's start the vehicle and see how it sounds. Push button ignition with your foot on the brake. Push the button to start. All right, let's pop the hood and see what we have.
Under the hood, we have the 3.5 liter direct injection V6 engine, seven speed automatic transmission with shift paddle, pushing out 302 horsepower and 273 pound feet of torque. EPA estimated fuel economy is 21 CD, 30 highway, and 24 combined. Can hit from 0 to 60 in 6.5 seconds. Here we have the three position memory seating and all four windows are fully automatic. And here's a closer look at the door panel. Beautiful wood and silver accenting trim. Harman Kardon sound system. The Mercedes-Benz aluminum door seal. Both driver and passenger get perforated seats with heated and ventilated option with white contrast stitching on all leather seats and door panels. Both driver and front passenger seats get 14-way power front seat with memory. Intuitive, seat shape control help you and your front passenger find your ideal seating position with 14-way power adjustment, including a power lumbar support. A memory system for each front seat recall three store seat position with a touch of a button. The driver seat memory also include the power steering column and the side mirror positions. The three spoke design steering wheel is fully wrapped in leather with perforated side grip, silver accenting in the middle, as well as multi-function control side by side for your convenience, featuring tilt and telescopic steering column. Located behind the wheel is the set of paddle shifter, just in case you want to put it in manual mode for a more aggressive ride. Alright, here's the gearbox, up for reverse. Once you're in reverse, the backup camera will show on the navigation screen with guidance line to help with a much easier backup. Down for neutral, down again for drive, press the P for park. Here we have the light control, the rear fog light, and driver air vent. The beautiful wood trim. Here at the center of the dash, we have the high resolution screen display, the double air vent with the analog clock in the middle, multimedia controlled, dual climate controlled. Here we have the ashtray and the cigarette lighter. Dual cup holder for driver and passenger. And here we have the command central controller. You can control your multimedia screen through the knob. Turn the knob around to move around screen. Move it up, down, left or right. And we'll push down to select. The center controller on the center console let you control the cockpit management and data system for your navigation unit. Also give you convenient control of audio, video, hand-free calling and optional navigation function. Many features can also be accessed via the integrated steering wheel control. Located next to the knob we have the back button, the favorite, the clear, Eco Sport Mode and here we have the center storage compartment with media interface cable as well as the USB plug. Glove box compartment and here's another look at the seat. Okay, up on the roof we have the light control. You can control the rear light, the front light, and uh, the Mercedes emergency roadside assistant button. That's the SOS button right there. One touch open, close and tilt moonroof button.
universal garage door opener sun visor mirror with a card holder all right let's take a look at the back have the automatic window button aluminum door sill the rear seats does offer split folded option which allow you to expand the cargo capacity of your E-Class sedan while still carrying a rear passenger. Elegantly redesigned cabin, a new 3 part gauge cluster highlight the enhanced style and feature of the 2014 E-Class. A timeless tradition of craftsmanship is apparent even in the modern material like the slick metallic trim hand polished wood components, hand fitted upholstery in a new palette of colors, a classic analog clock to celebrate the iconic Mercedes sedan of the past. Light control for the rear passenger. Here we have the armrest. with a storage compartment and dual cup holder for the rear passenger. Here's the back Harman Kardon speakers. Also have two air vents for the passenger. Ashtray and the 12 volt power outlet. There is plenty of room for the rear passenger. Here's the rear pockets for the rear seat. The back can fit three adults easily. Alright, let's pop the trunk. The trunk offers 15.9 cubic feet of cargo space and for added convenience there is a slide push down cargo net for smaller items so that they don't roll all over the trunk and as I mentioned earlier the seat does fold down and you can fold it down via the lever located inside the trunk for your convenience one touch close button the back seat in the E350 sedan is pleasantly spacious matching the BMW 5 Series for the most hospitable in the mid-size luxury class. The cabin of the 2014 Mercedes-Benz E-Class looks almost identical to its predecessor at first glance, but there are meaningful changes here. A revised 3-tube gauge cluster at visual interest. A new Mercedes brand analog clock Add a touch of class to every E-Class dashboard, the three available wood trim option is a nice no-cost opportunity to personalize your Mercedes-Benz. Alright guys, leave me a comment below, tell me what you think about the 2014 E-Class. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for future in-depth video reviews. I'll see you guys next time.